Hi friends, in this session we will see one of the most common interview question, reverse individual words in a given string. Here is the input string and expected output string. There are two ways to address this problem. In first approach, we will break the string using spaces and on top of each token, we perform reverse operation. One of the drawback with this approach is it requires additional space to keep all the tokens. So the next best approach is using stack. So in this what we do, we will read character by character and push all the characters until we encounter a space. The moment we encounter a space, we will pop out character by character and print it. So for example, if we take this input string, we will read character by character and start pushing. So it will start with H. We'll push H, next character is E, next character is L, next one is L, next one is O. The next character is space. The moment we encounter space, we have to pop out each element and print it. So when we perform pop, the first one is O, the second one is L, the next one is L, and then E, H. Automatically, it reverses the word without any additional storage. Let's write a code. Create a new class. Reverse string. We'll declare a static method. The return type is void, which returns nothing. Reverse string. It takes one input parameter of type string. We'll name it input. We'll declare one stack of character. We have to iterate through the input string and read character by character. So we'll use for loop. I less than input dot length length of the string i plus plus get the character based on index i character c equal to input dot care at i now let's see what is this character in case if it is a character we need to flush out the string flush out the stack in case the character is not a space we need to push it to the stack if c double equal to space we need to flush out the stack else we need to push character to stack stack dot push c so here until the stack is empty pop out each character and print it we'll use while loop the exit condition is stack not empty we need to print it so we'll use system dot out dot print stack dot pop pop will return the deleted element after while loop, we'll introduce extra space. So that's a separator for each word in the sentence in the given string. System dot So this this will help us to reverse individual words in the given string. We have to consider one edge case given string there will be multiple words separated by space but the last word will not have any empty space sorry any space at the end so the specific word will be inside 
stack only so after this while loop we need to flush out the stack to get the to get the last word printed on the console so we'll just copy paste and use the while loop here now now let's test the code we'll write a main method the input string is hello world we'll call reverse string and pass input now let's run the code and see the result as expected this code reversed each individual word not the entire string thanks for watching please subscribe to the channel